Miss Foxy by nature tuning in. Thanks for tuning in again with me, uh, folks. Today I'm going to do something a little bit different. It's Sunday and I've already done my makeup. We're not going to do anything with applying makeup or taking any makeup off. Today I'm going to show you just a simple trick to do to clean your makeup brushes. Um, I These are my makeup tools that I use to apply the makeup on my face and I find that it's very important to keep your makeup brushes clean and free of any bacteria that can form um, from reapplying the makeup. So once a week or once uh, every two weeks, take some time to clean your makeup brushes. And so that's what I'm gonna focus on today is to show you how to clean your makeup brushes with just some simple things that you may already have around the house. So we're gonna use simple, just baby shampoo. And it doesn't have to be a name brand baby shampoo or anything like that. So I, I just bought this baby shampoo from the dollar store. Um, and we're going to use that because you want something gentle to use on your makeup brushes. So that way you can uh, keep your make makeup brushes and don't have to keep repurchasing them. But as long as you keep them clean, you can really keep your makeup brushes for a very long time. So because it's a good investment. So here we're going to do. These are our tools. We're going to have baby shampoo. I also have a makeup brush cleaner. It's like a little device that you put on your fingers and you just kind of brush your brushes. Or you can basically just use your fingers or your hands. So I'm gonna show you both ways on how you can do that. Okay, so we're gonna get started. We're back. So now I'm just gonna show you how we actually clean our makeup brushes. I'm gonna start by running water. Just dampening our brush. And you want to keep the brush angled down because you don't want the water to go in, up into the device or the barrel of the brush. You want to try to keep all the water out of there as much as possible. We're going to take some baby shampoo and just kind of place it on our hands, like so. And we're just using the hand method for right now. You're just going to take your makeup brush and just kind of go back and forth in your fingers. And if you look at it very carefully, you'll see all the makeup kind of going into your hands. If you want to go in for a second wash, you can do that. Just add a little more shampoo to your hands. This time I'm going to add um, a little shampoo to the device that we're using. A little on there. So if you didn't want to use your fingers, you can actually use the brush cleaner itself. And once you see the water runs clear and there's no more makeup in there, then you can just go ahead and pretty much that particular brush is ready to be set aside. So what you want to do now is you take your makeup brush and you're going to apply it and you're just going to kind of brush it on a, a clean towel. It could be a clean white towel and just kind of brush it along. and then you'll notice that there's no makeup coming out on the, on the towel, then you know your makeup brush is clean, ready. And when you're done, you just kind of want to take the makeup brush and let it hang off to the side over a countertop or a desk, makeup desk that you have, and just kind of let it dry there. Now you may not be able to see that, but I have it over here to the left of me and it's kind of hanging off to the side and it's drying. So we're going to try one more brush. I'm going to try a lighter brush so that you can see more of the uh, cleaner or the makeup coming out of the brush.
You take it and you dry it on your towel as much as possible. Get as much of the water off as possible if you can. <clears throat> There you have it. You got another clean makeup brush. Take it and hang it off to the side on the counter just so it can dry. It's best to do this maybe at night before you go to bed so that way when you wake up in the morning your brushes will be dry so you can go ahead and apply your makeup again in the morning. So, thanks for following me. So that's one of our helpful tips for today to keep your makeup brushes clean. Thank you. Follow me at girlyoufoxy.com.